Hey guys, it's DigiPez here. We're just about to jump into a game of Fracture on Berserk, which is from the previous DLC, I believe. Let's go. Usually I'm quite offensive, so let's go with the Kuda. Ooh. Oh, wow. Good start. Good start. Anyway, I'm playing this today. Um, because... Oh! Because I wanted to have a quick chat about Modern Warfare Remastered. Smoke them. And clear up any confusion that you have to pre order Modern Warfare. No, you have to pre order Infinite Warfare in order to. in order to obtain Modern Warfare Remastered. Modern Warfare Remastered is not a pre order bonus. And I guarantee that there's going to be a ton of Infinite Warfare Legacy Editions on the shelves from launch day. So my advice is, quite simply, just hold off, because unless... Oh, hello. I'll take those, thank you. Because quite frankly, we don't know what we're getting. And the pre-order bonuses this year, I have to say, I'm like I've pre-ordered every game since Profit KIA. Mm, I wanna say since Black Ops 1, I think it was the first game I pre-ordered. And ever since then we've been getting pretty reasonable, you know, pretty good deals. But this year it's like, would you get a cosmetics pack? Which probably almost definitely be made available, they always are, further down the line. Um, oh, they got me there. What are we on? Almost pretty much 11 kill streak. Yes, you get a cosmetics pack. Um, Triple. Um, God, I can't. I can't even remember. So they cl they clearly <laughs> couldn't have been that enticing. Enemy down. Oh no! Thank you. Sniper, head down. Oh, they got to come from behind. No, 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 come on, get inside. Oh, what? Damn, that was unlucky. I don't know what it was about Black Ops 3. I don't know if it was the... Um... Wow. I don't know if it was the poor DLC performance from the outset or the fact that they patched the game so much. It was incredibly difficult to recognise the game day in, day out. Um... Wow. Actually destroying my, my amazing, amazing gameplay so far. Whoop. Getting out of there. Um. Where was this sniper? Yeah, they patched this game so much it was Smoke, unrecognizable. Check. Then they started adding. Whoa! No, no, no! Then they started adding DLC packs that made the game look like it was made for like 12 year olds. Oh, I'm sorry, but. For a, for a game that has such a confident, smooth movement system, it's gone severely downhill. Well, I don't mind the aesthetic of the game if they didn't patch it so much. And I mean, like, sure, get rid of the, um, oh, get rid of the, uh, 
dodgy glitches and all that, but don't like over patch weapons because then you just you get tired of having to readjust. Like sure, advanced warfare have a massively overpowered weapon in that game. So and that never really got fixed. But this game it, it was alright. You know, there wasn't anything that was massively if you ha I think my view is if you have a few overpowered slightly overpowered weapons, then those that use the other weapons and get good with them feel more rewarded. Enemy down. Like, I don't see that. There have been games in the past where I've had no problem with there being a couple of overpowered weapons. You know? Enemy down. Oh no, I don't want a locust. Oh, here's where we put my sniping abilities to the test. Where are they coming from now? UAV inbound. UAV. Oh, massively balls that out. I should have used my most freakies with the older. Yeah, I've lost, uh, I don't know, I've just lost touch with uh, the new, uh, oh, he didn't see me at all, the new Call of Duty Panda to Children kind of says it, because that's what this game does, like, fucking dabs in it and, like, sniper down. A dab should not be in a military shooter. <laughs> or at least not one that's, you know, Black Ops 1 was the last game that I think I really enjoyed. And that's because it was, you bought into the whole real, you know, sort of realism in quotation marks of the game. It was gritty. It was bloody. It was, you know, it was a military shooter that made you buy into the game. Around the game with a nice solid triple. Great working. Oh yes, boy. Terrible performance, CDP. Solid game. Come on home. Even this though we lost. Charlie Fox Request immediate dust off and even. Yeah, Infinite Warfare could be a great game. Uh, But I'm not gonna buy from the warfare just to get access to Modern Warfare. Emails. The chances are it's gonna be released further down the line. And just remember, Modern Warfare Remastered is not a pre-order bonus. You don't have to give them your money ahead of the game to access the game. I'm not trying to stop you from buying the game, I'm just saying buy smart. So I hope you enjoyed the gameplay. I've been DigiPez, and I will speak to you soon. Sweetness.